Hello everyone, I'm the Gamer Resigning 6 and this is my 75th ever video. I need to do something special next week. It's gonna be 76 for the 76. Today, I'm gonna be doing some digital art. I don't know how to, t I'm gonna title this video. Doing more digital art or like, Christmas in July video or whatever. I meant to do this last week because it was on the 75th, but not the 75th, the 25th, but uh, I already recorded the intro beforehand of the previous video. If I had to redo the intro, it would like mess it up. So I had to postpone this to this week, which is good because my art wasn't done by then. This is only two drawings, that's why this video is so short. And it is two pairs of two. Two. By the way, this art I'm doing today is going to be on my merch store because the drawings on there are really ugly right now. I want to freshen it up. I'm not deleting the old designs because I have too much sentimental value. But yeah, I'm adding these two designs. Link in the description. Where do you think you're going? You're gonna spoil yourself for the video. Gosh, you really don't. Mm, really disrespectful. Start drawing. Okay, so first I'm drawing my favorites, Jane and June. Right off the bat, you may realize that this isn't the shape of a bear. I'm drawing them as humans because I wanted to redo a picture I did of them a while ago, but I thought I already had released that one so I made them people. Until I noticed there was no listing of it, and when I went back and looked at it, it looked like this. <laughs> Terrible. So I'll probably redo the bear version another day, but today is the people version because I already finished before I looked at it. Anyways, let's talk about my design choices for their human forms. Even though June is canonically the one who loves food the most, I felt more like Jane would be plus-sized and June would be more fit body type. This could make sense for two reasons. One, they are fictional characters and they don't need to follow the laws of our world. And two, people have different metabolism speeds, so this is actually ultra-realistic. This scene is, Jane noticed June looked cold, and because Jane is so sweet, she gave June her scarf. And June was very moved by this, they fell in love all over again, because this is after they already got together. And while I'm lining, I'm going to mention that because of the clothes I chose for Jane, she kind of looks like a doctor, and for some reason the pigtails make her look more like one to me. Of course, I colored them in with the colors that fit their Squishies color scheme, which means Jane is green, June is blue, and Jane's browns are slightly lighter than June's browns. And also, I made the scarf green. Even though it's on June, it belongs to Jane, so it fits her color scheme. Now that their coloring is done, I'm sketching a bench to make them a location to be in. Behold, the power of digital art. I sketched the shape I want the legs of the bench to be, then I used the distort option to make it in the right perspective, and I copy-paste it so both would look the same, just like they would in real life. And now lining the bench with no commentary needed. And now coloring in the bench with light shading. Now I'm drawing a background for them with a slowy, slowy? Now I'm drawing a background for them with a snowy floor and dark sky. And I myself don't know if it's just late in the day or if it's snowing so hard it blocked the sun. Now it's done. I did add shading off camera because I edited this and then I realized I didn't add shading and I wanted shading but I didn't want to re-edit it. Quick interruption between drawings to tell you that not only am I adding today's two drawings to my merch store, I am also adding the painting I did on my sketchbook last week, but like it says notebook instead of sketchbook because I can't make it lineless, well I haven't figured out how if I can. And also, I had this wave of inspiration for this hoodie inspired by Jane and June, my two favorites. It might have a little bit of weird resolution, but whatever. I unfortunately don't have them here because for two reasons. I literally set them up yesterday and I don't have money. So maybe I'll have enough money to buy the hoodie by December. Anyways, to the next drawing. Okay, so the first one was kind of just a winter themed drawing that I just happened to draw in July. But this one is true Christmas in July with summer environment and Christmas themes on top, such as my two Christmas time characters, Cindy the Yule Goat, which um, is Yule, not Christmas, but it's around the same time, 
and Pengui the reindeer, who I decided on her name today. And I chose that because she was made in the same video as a penguin, and I thought it would be funny after someone suggested something similar. And also, unfortunately, the penguin, who I named Franklin by the way, could not be here because he actually needs to be in cold weather. They're in pool floaties because July is hot. At least where I am. I don't I don't know about you. And they need to cool down. Also they have drinks for refreshment. Now with blue, I'm sketching a background, which is mostly water and sky, with, with just a bit of beach showing, with an umbrella and one beach towel. Why not two? I have no idea. I just drew one for some reason. Maybe one of them just doesn't want one. Or maybe they share. Take your pick. I did originally have the umbrella as pink but I thought green would fit the Christmas colors more, even though I love pink. Now I line everything. Then coloring started with Pengui's side. <laughs> Her floaty is Santa suit themed. And I am going to point out that in universe, it is only printed to look like fur. It is not actually fur, because that would get gross in water. Then I colored in her drink, red straw, green drink, and I even made it a transparent thing and also slightly white tinted cup. Then I colored Cindy, and her drink is the opposite of Pengui's, and her floaty is a Christmas tree with red ornaments. And I'm coloring the Christmas lights on Pengui's antlers, which you may not have even noticed, haha, <laughs> surprised ya. And now shadows are being added, which are kind of subtle. Now it's finished. I hope you like it. Outro time. I hope you like the two drawings I did today. Which one's your favorite? Um, comment down below. Comment down below if you want me to revamp that um, actual bear form version of the Jane and Jude drawing. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you made it this far. If it's your birthday, happy birthday, and goodbye. <laughs>